The condemnation of violence within the Jamaican society doesn't seem to be enough to prevent the spiraling crime rate. Of great concern to one justice of the peace is the gender-based violence that has enveloped the society. Kenton Brown's death after being doused with a chemical substance and set on fire by his common-law wife has her speaking out about men and how they are sometimes treated. Not because he's a man. I think this is something that we should handle and treat very serious. Because I have known men who have suffered abuse and it just swept under the carpet. Miss McIntosh explains that the Jamaican culture of how a man should be and behave is having a negative impact on the society. She wants these notions to change as according to her, men, even if they are suffering, prefer not to share their situation with anyone. Because of the way society had treated boys and men, um, men not supposed to cry, just like boys, and even us as mothers, if something happened to our boys, we don't expect them to cry because we would say, oh, you behave like a girl. She's of the view that the country would have reacted differently had Kenton Brown been the perpetrator. Because if it was a woman, the whole world would hear about it. The whole Jamaica would hear about it. She wants the relevant authorities to seriously address the crime issue. No respect for life. No respect for the law anymore. Come on, man. The law must show its muscle. Marjorie Gordon, CVM News.